How to Join Polyethylene Sheets If you're working on a project that involves joining polyethylene sheets, you're probably wondering about the best ways to do it. Let's break it down step by step. First, it's important to understand that polyethylene sheets, especially high-density polyethylene, HDPE, can be tricky to join because they have a low surface energy. This means traditional glues often don't work well. One effective method is using a heat gun to fuse the sheets together. This process is known as butt welding. Here's how you can do it. Start by overlapping the two sheets of polyethylene by about six inches. Make sure the edges are aligned properly. Place a piece of plywood underneath the overlap to provide a solid base. Use a heat gun to carefully heat the overlap section, moving the gun slowly back and forth. You'll see the plastic start to melt and bond together. Keep the heat gun at a safe distance to avoid making holes in the plastic. Once the area is heated, it will take less time to weld the rest of the joint. Continue this process along the entire length of the overlap until you have a solid watertight seam. Another method involves using specialized welding tools that generate heat through hot air or heated plates. These tools are designed specifically for plastic welding and can provide a strong and visually pleasing joint. The technique and equipment used depend on the thickness of the sheets and the desired strength of the joint. For a more DIY approach, you can use a specialized tape with a thermoplastic adhesive layer. This tape is activated by pressure and heat, making it a good option for smaller projects. Simply apply the tape to the joint, apply pressure, and use a heat source to activate the adhesive. If you prefer a mechanical method, you can use rivets. Rivets are used to permanently secure the sheets together. This involves drilling holes through both sheets and inserting the rivets. While this method is very traditional and cost-effective, it does require destroying the rivet or the workpiece to separate them. Each of these methods has its own advantages and is suitable for different types of projects. Whether you're working on a greenhouse, a construction site, or any other application, choosing the right method will ensure a strong and durable bond between your polyethylene sheets.